the video I just wanted to share this with you as you can see I'm now able to fuse a rank 1 talent choice chest so let's just go over there <clears throat> and do that in the dragon land so I'm gonna fuse this now and as you can see gives you the option to select a talent which is which is great so I'm just gonna fuse it I haven't really looked into those so don't expect me to give you the min max on that uh, because I myself don't know it yet you have these uh, where were they yes just like here so you have the rank 1, rank 2, rank 3 talents, uh, so basically as you can see um, damage plus 0.4%, damage red plus 0.4%, uh, oh my god, 0.4%, then you have the fatal damage and you have uh, your damage red, so fatal damage is good because that's the highest that you do and I'm thinking I'm just gonna uh, get this one increased because that's the overall excellent excellent damage red fatal and fatal damage red so i'm thinking fatal damage uh, increase is a good thing so i'm gonna go with that let me just open the box real quick <clears throat> uh, maybe it's okay that's the wrong box <laughs> sorry about that there we have it so use it and then let's see excellent damage up excellent damage down that's interesting increase excellent damage red increase excellent damage fatal damage and then of course yeah so that's the one we need we're gonna open it we're gonna go to talent activate and it's a 12,000 increase but again you have uh, the fatal damage increase that's basically the damage that I got from the lucky stone on my uh, R4 uh, let me just exactly at the bottom lucky stat fatal damage 15% base gear and so on and so forth so that's the blue damage that you're uh, doing which also let me just check uh, overall damage well, yeah, that's um, <clears throat> a bit higher now. I'm in the safe zone. Let me just get out of here. Can I put myself... Okay, that just went down, which is interesting. Let's so go aid. <clears throat> Just to check it out. There you have the increase, so 61 to 92,000. Then right now, as you can see, 430 uh, fatal damage. That's what I'm doing right now with almost 8 million power, so 878, 5772 for the power. Um, it's definitely interesting, but wait, which boss is alive? I didn't see any. Okay, show me that I have 40 points basically that I can uh, kill a boss on there. So I'm gonna do this. Sadly, not uh, many eggs. I didn't purchase uh, the eggs yesterday. At least not all of them, because I was tired, went to bed early, <laughs> uh, like an old guy. So, this one, so I started fusing as many as I can. My opinion doesn't really give you that much, because... Um, when you sum up the amount that you are using there, it's better to use them single, but still. <clears throat> so, attack increase. Um, 
So I didn't use all of these yesterday for the eggs, but I'm not getting all that many eggs um, for the red dragons, which would give me the access to uh, Kalima. So I'm basically always buying those, which is wasting a ton of my diamonds, which have diminished again, sadly. Uh, but I wanted to show you another thing. Let me just go there real quick. I'm gonna do a separate video about it, just um, explaining that a bit more on another character because I can show you everything on this one. But here you have in Laurentia this uh, mystery shop. As you can see, it requires a certain amount of points for you to buy stuff. A rank 4 random gear chest, rank 5 fear chest, and so on. And you have Open locks, feather for 20 points. So I'm gonna just purchase one. You have five a day of those. And in order to get the points, you can sell, let's say, skills, you can sell uh, rank three equipment. So that's what you sell in here in order to gain those points and be able to buy that. Um, it's a good way to collect the broken feathers. I mean, I, that's the first one I buy, the other seven I got from the bosses, uh, from the ancient bosses that I've been killing, or uh, from the excellent bosses. Um, I'm buying these to get 100 to get the mount. Um, here, Lock's Feather in the Faction Mall, in the Dragon's Land, 20,000 points. I only have <clears throat> nearly a thousand, so that, uh, that's not much, and for the third wing, you have this broken condor feathers, condor flames, sorry, uh, and you need 50 of those to get the condor flame, like the lox feather, basically the equivalent for the rank three wings. And here you can buy uh, chaos and so on. As you can see, lifetime offer three, so I could buy them and upgrade my wing further, which at the moment I don't want to do. And yeah, that's basically it. Uh, another thing to the mystery shop, you probably noticed that, but just to show you once more, you have your rings and pendants here. So basically you can sell the gear, buy the rings in here uh, instead of the diamonds, and then basically upgrade that. Let's just do this here as well. Yeah, that's okay. -ish. Um, something else that happened. You see, there's this lucky treasure here. Five day login hasn't started yet. I don't know why they have it in the game. It's probably buggy right now because you cannot see anything. It shows me that I have it. I haven't logged in, uh, re logged in yet to see if that would do something. But when I click it, nothing happens and the game starts to freeze, basically. I'm just gonna <clears throat> check real quick as soon as I'm able to close it. Because again, it's lagging. Um, just claim this real quick. Or rather, upgrade it. So let's do this. Go back. I can't wait for uh, level 100 to be able to do the next uh, road to Mu quest. So let's see here. Yeah, it's still there. It's still there. I'm just gonna click it. As soon as it loads, as you can see, it's pretty, pretty laggy for some reason. I think it completely... okay, no, it didn't. But again, it's not on yet. So don't wonder why you have this. It's an event, it's gonna come up. I had it on my Blade Knight, so yeah, keep that in mind. As usual, thanks for watching. Hope the information was useful. Thumbs up, comment, subscribe. See you next time.